Well, as you know, my dad worked in the, in the steel mill. Well, before we go there, uh, let me mention that uh, the, uh, the Polish people in Necrona got together, the men got together and they enlisted to uh, go to Europe and fight in World War I. Like door to door, literally. The Polish people rallied. Oh, yeah, in Poland? Poland? No, no, here in Petrona. <coughs> oh, okay. uh, Steve has a book. It's a history of the uh, Polish people who uh, served in the army uh, during uh, World War I. And um, his picture is in there twice. Now, uh, my dad was the first soldier from Natrona to be wounded in the First World War. Mm -hmm. And um, he was gassed, he got mustard gas, and uh, caught shrapnel in, um, in the neck and both wrists and in both legs. Um, to me it would appear that he was walking or running toward the uh, shell mm -hmm. when it exploded and he was uh, laying in the trench and the uh, the Krauts launched a gas mortar attack because the weather was just right for gas because mm -hmm. it hugged the ground. <coughs> I guess it was a combination of the humidity, you know, the heat and the wind direction and um, the gas was about four or five feet off the ground. You know, it didn't dissipate up into the air. Mm -hmm. It went along the ground and, well, he got a mouthful of that stuff. And uh, ever since he was gassed, every, every day when he got <clears throat> up from sleeping, uh, he'd have to go into the bathroom and just hack himself, hack, hack to get all that junk out of his uh, lungs mm -hmm. and uh, on top of what he smoked. <laughs> so, yeah, he worked in the mill all his life. He was a crane man. Can I say something? Mm -hmm. You're like a politician, Dad. You're not answering this question. Maybe that's by nature. <laughs> <laughs> 